Jump rope, if you do it often enough and at a high intensity, as I usually do it, like back in the day, not anymore. <laughs> It makes you hungry. Like, I know people don't talk about it, but it's true. Jump rope makes you mad hungry. So you really have to watch your calories if you are doing, like, super jump rope. If you're jumping rope, like, two or three times a day, which is what I used to do back in the day, and really burning calories, I would go home and, like, take them all back in, right? I used to... Like, I don't work out as much anymore for health reasons and other things, but I'm getting back to myself. And, um, yeah, and also, um, I know a few of you guys have made... <laughs> Not you guys online, but like some comments about like my weight and stuff like that. Guys, come on now. I'm not even the one to try to like shade and like dislike that. It doesn't really affect me because I know I gain weight. Like, what's the big deal? I'm 54 years old. I'm in menopause. I'm going through the whole thing. My eating habits are like shitty to, to say the least. Um, but I, I own it. All right, I own it. But despite all of that, I'm still badass with that rope. Facts. It's true, all right? And I don't try to put any pressure on myself with regard to social media and people saying, oh, you're fat or you gain weight, whatever. It happens. You gain weight, you lose weight when it's the right time. And that goes for men and women of all ages and all stages, okay? So drop the fear drop the stress just when you are ready to get back into your fitness routine and you're ready to get back to you just do it right put your blinders on and get to work which is what i've been doing so i'm not really like stressed out too much i'm enjoying my summer um it's the only thing i kind of regret is that there's no traveling for me this year um mainly due um to covid and um some of the COVID outbreaks in um, um, at some of the resorts where I was supposed to work uh, in Mexico. So I was supposed to go to Mexico, Jamaica, um, St. Martin, French St. Martin, um, and St. Lucia, right? Um, and then obviously New York, but um, didn't happen, and it's not going to happen. So I'm, in, I'm I'm really enjoying my um, time out in nature, and um, I'm looking forward to getting back to work next month. You know nicely refreshed some of you guys have asked me if i if i'm still not sleeping it's still a thing i still have the insomnia nothing i can do i'm just you know it's part of the whole menopause syndrome whatever but what can you do right hormonal issues are bananas but again i accept it i accept myself which is what you all should do okay